Hello, boys and girls, and welcome back to another spooky and exciting episode of Imaginative Stories. Yay! As always, my name is Glorp. How are you? Wonderful! I have a question for you all. How many of you have ever been judged by the way you look or act? I see. Well, I'm here to tell you that you are not alone. Because I myself have been judged as well. Because there are people that sometimes think that all monsters are just mean and scary. And I'm here to tell you that that is not true. Because as a monster myself, I am very kind and nice. And that is what today's book is about. How not to judge others based on their appearance or how they act or may seem. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the story. A Very Brave Witch by Allison McGee and Harry Bliss You're not going to believe this, but... Poof! I'm a witch! My favorite holiday? Well, what do you think? That's right, Halloween! I love the decorations. And I especially love the costumes. You might not believe this, but most witches are afraid of humans. Did she say humans? Why? Because, well, humans aren't green like us. I'm not afraid, though. I've done my research. Here are the facts. Strange but true. Most humans are afraid to fly. Most humans do not wear pointy hats. Humans are rarely known to cackle. Nothing too bad, except, you know, the green thing. It's time for this brave witch to take a closer look. Hang on, kitty. We're going in. Listen, what's that I hear those humans saying? Trick a tree? No one can trick a tree like me. Yikes. Are you okay? A real human. Sweet costume. That was quite a spill. I'm being touched by a human hand. I've always dreamed of flying. Flying? Have I got a treat for you? Hop on. Some witches, the very brave ones, are not afraid of humans. And some humans, the very brave ones, are not afraid to fly. Happy Halloween! The end. Well, boys and girls, I hope you enjoyed today's book, and I hope it taught you that you should never judge a book by its cover, that we should all learn to accept each other for who we are, inside and out no matter what we look like or how we act or where we're from. Well, anyways, I have to get going to a Halloween party, and I hope you all have a safe and happy Halloween! Until next time, bye!